Greetings dear learners and welcome to the course Model Diplomacy in a Chaotic World. In this module, you will understand the background of United Nations and the Model United Nations conferences covering their definitions, historical backgrounds and core themes. So before we move any further, let us understand the definition of United Nations and the core concept on which United Nations operates. Oxford University defines United Nations as an association of many countries that aims to improve economic and social conditions and to solve political problems in the world in a peaceful way. But I think one definition that would be apt for this organization is given by the organization itself. United Nations defines itself as one place where the world's nations can gather together, discuss common problems and find shared solutions. Now that we have established the definition of United Nations organization as an organization where different world powers come together to discuss their problems, let us now move on to understand its core concept. Here is a reflection spot question that would help you to relate to the concept of United Nations. Now kindly pause the video for 2 minutes and answer the question that will be displayed on the screen. Imagine you have a group of 5 friends and 2 of these 5 friends get into an argument leading to a fight. Now how would you solve this dispute and ensure that this group does not split? You might have the following answers. You would make the two members sit together and talk it out. You would take the suggestions from all the group members and come up with a mutually agreed solution. Entire group would gather and put forward their individual views and sides on the issue. Punish the member who according to you has started the dispute. In the real world, where there are many more members resulting in many more disputes, the United Nations organization steps in to perform these similar functions but in a larger scale and thus, it acts as a platform for dispute resolution, it gives all its members an equal opportunity to put forward their views on the issue, it provides valuable solutions and suggestions to the problem at hand, it, if necessary, even punishes certain members through sanctions, interventions or legal procedures. The United Nations organization was formed only in 1945, but this core concept of different countries or parties coming together to resolve dispute existed from the time of the Greek civilization, where different members of the oligarchy came together for dispute resolution and policy formulation. And through this core concept emerged the phenomena of Model UN Conferences. Model United Nations, as the name suggests, is a model or a simulation based on the workings of the United Nations. These MUNs are organized mainly by students of schools and colleges, where each student represents a country or a portfolio and thus has to act and speak on behalf of that portfolio. These conferences discuss real-time problems of current or historical nature and are modeled after the actual United Nations committees, agendas, procedures and powers. Now let us summarize our learning. The United Nations is an organization where different countries from all over the world come together to discuss problems and arrive at solutions. Modern United Nations conferences is an academic simulation of United Nations where each participant represents a country or a portfolio and thus has to act and speak on behalf of that country or portfolio. In our next video, we will dive deeper into understanding the historical roots and evolution of United Nations organization and the model UN conferences. Thank you.